The Great Meadow as a green frontier of a climate-neutral Europe. After the destruction of the Kohovka hydroelectric power plant in 2023, Ukraine faced a large-scale man-made disaster. that unexpectedly led to the emergence of a unique ecological phenomenon. The beginning of the revival of one of Europe's most magnificent natural landscape. The Great Meadow – Veliki Luch On the former riverbed, new ecosystems are forming naturally, including fast-growing willow forests that are already demonstrating high biological productivity, resilience to climate fluctuations, and the ability to sequester carbon. At present, this territory has become the largest forest area in southern Ukraine. formed without human intervention. According to our observation, as of 2024, more than 60 species of vascular plants have been recorded here. Young phytocenosis shows active development dynamics, biodiversity and the ability to perform phytoremediation functions by purifying soil from pollutants. This newly formed ecosystem align with the key principles of the European Green Deal, particularly the goal of achieving climate neutrality by 2050, and the implementation of the new European Union Forest Strategy for 2030. They have significant potential for reducing greenhouse gas emissions stabilizing the local climate and supporting biodiversity. In contrast, plans to restore the Kohovka hydroelectric plant by reflooding the area contradict the principles of sustainable development and climate responsibility. Such an action would destroy ecosystems that have already proven their value as natural carbon pumps and eliminate opportunities for scientific research, ecological tourism and the establishment of a world-class nature reserve. Thus, the Great Meadow in its new form is not only a national natural heritage that has been given a second life, but also an eastern green frontier that can become a symbol of Ukrainians' participation in a climate-neutral future for Europe. That is why, on the second anniversary of the destruction of the Kahovka Reservoir, a tragedy that must not be forgotten, we are reminded of the fragility of our world. It is essential to support the Ukrainian state and its armed forces in defending European civilization frontier. Just as importantly, we must support the scientists, who are now protecting a different kind of frontier, a green one. We must continue to study this unprecedented act of ecocide and the way nature itself is working to save us from even greater environmental disasters. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, where we explore urgent environmental issues, as well as the rich history and culture of Ukraine. Together, let's better understand and care for our world.